So this is a meeting of the Hingham Historical Commission, Wednesday, June 9th, uh, 2021, starting at uh, 7.03 p.m. This meeting is being held remotely as an alternate means of public access pursuant to an order issued by the governor of Massachusetts dated March 12, 2020, suspending certain provisions of the open meeting law. You are hereby advised that this meeting and all communications during this meeting may be recorded by the town of Hingham in accordance with the open meeting law. I wish to advise everyone that the meeting is in fact being recorded as Andrea Young just mentioned. And also ask that if anyone other than uh, Harbor Media is going to record uh, this meeting, that they uh, let us know now so that uh, all the participants are aware that they're being recorded by a third party. Is anyone recording the meeting today besides Harbor Media? Seeing and hearing no affirmative response, we'll move right to the, uh, I think what we should do is skip over public comment unless there's someone that has a public comment item that they want to address before we go to the Greenbush Historic Preservation Trust so that we can have the presentations by those applicants. Um, seeing and hearing uh, no one affirmatively um, wishing to make public comment, uh, why don't we go right to the applications and uh, no one has any objection. I will uh, call on the applicants in the order that I received. Uh, they were stacked in the package, so it's a random selection. And the first package that in my package of applications was a 
agreement with the Kersey uh, family when he thought that they would not change any of the tenants' leases for three years. So he did not at that time let people know that it was going to take three years for him to start. So anyway, I thought we were going to have a, an assessment of that wall sooner. But okay. that's not a so I know. No. I know. I know. So no. I'm hoping that Old Colony Masons will, will be giving me that because they were there on Tuesday. Okay, that's all. Thank you. Does anyone else have any questions? Um, seeing none, I would just ask so, just for avoidance of doubt and clarity, the current project ask is 3200 just to do the stairway. That the balance of the retaining wall or the wall to the west might be an ask from another, you know, next year or some other project. Is that fair to say? That, that is fair to say. Thank you. Yes. So, and I can't resist but saying, and, and it's that in part because of all this quiet on the western front at this point. Very good. It has been quiet on the western front, and ignorance is bliss, which is, is basically why it looks like what it looks like right now. Does anyone else have any questions uh, at this point? Um, seeing or hearing none, I think we can move on next week. Uh, we will deliberate. Everyone is welcome to attend, obviously, and, and hear it. And occasionally a question will come up uh, during the deliberation process, so I would encourage the applicants to attend because sometimes there's a question that develops during the uh, intervening week that you know would be helpful if you're available to answer. But um, I, on behalf of all the commission members, want to thank all of the applicants for coming forward. It's nice to see projects downtown that are trying to uh, maintain or improve you know, historic structures and areas downtown. So thank you very much. Mr. Chairman, with respect to our next meeting, um, we received word today that um, for some reason um, the state of emergency is ending as of the 15th of June, which is this coming Monday, and it was moved back apparently from August. So in order for us to continue Zoom meetings, um, we would need, the legislature would have to um, uh, approve that. And so we've been instructed to meet in the building. So we will be at Town Hall next Wednesday, beginning at 7 o'clock. I don't know which room yet, but I will let you know. Thank you. Uh, so everybody knows that. Can I ask a question? Sure. Uh, next week, Wednesday at 7 p.m. is the CPC meeting. Um, is there a way to know, will this be first on the agenda? We can do that. Can we, Mr. Chairman? Put Judy first so she can get to the meeting. I have no problem with that. Thank you. Um, so I would encourage everybody to come and attend and uh, then maybe um, we can send off certain retiring commission members in style. <laughs> maybe open a tab down at the uh, snug and look across the street toward uh, the Ebenezer Gate. Uh, the Western Wall. <laughs> okay, thanks folks for coming. Um, Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. And that brings us to the next item on the agenda, which is the parish house. Um, I think Jim Conroy wants to uh, help us in that regard. Thank you, Kevin. Yeah, first of all, I, I wanted to explain my absence last month. Uh, I think it's the right time I missed a meeting. And it was an important one on the East Street property, but I would have, uh, I would have gone the way the commission went, so nothing, uh, nothing changed. But, um, we did have a good excuse. Our, uh, our grandchild was 
copy of the link. So uh, ho hopefully uh, all of you can uh, make that meeting at 7 o'clock with the Zoom meeting and, uh, and hear the start of the dialogue. Really, tomorrow night is the beginning of concerns expressed by all of you, all the neighbors, or anyone else who wants to chime in. Uh, he's not announcing anything or, or any plans, but he's, he'll give you a kind of a broad overview of how he intends to go forward, and uh, and he wants to hear what the, what the town thinks uh, about the project. So, this is not this is not our meeting, really. It's DJ, DJ's meeting. So that's a little bit about that. And, and while I'm speaking, I, I can also uh, bring, bring up an issue that Andrew had mentioned to me just yesterday or the day before, I guess, that some people have uh, been wanting to see a copy of the archaeological uh, report that was done. 
Thank you. 